There it is. Hello, Logan, you're going to be watching now later on the YouTube, leading here along with... Drakir! And welcome to, uh, yeah, a bit of a makeup stream, since Sunday went kind of wonky <laughs> and left me rather pissed off. Uh, so, yeah, originally I was planning to play a game called Leg uh, Fairy Legends of Avalon, but apparently that game just doesn't want to start. There's something wrong with its, pro with its code with uh, NVIDIA Fizz X. That uh, yeah, it's going to take longer for me to fix that than I want to put into it right now. So yeah, instead, Dying Light, and after this, Far Cry 2. Both very All good right. games. Yeah, and before we get that, it's it's only me, or is the moving takes very acting weird on your end? No. It's going back and forth a lot for me. Okay, that might be Discord. But, uh, yeah, as you can see, the sequel to this game is coming out soon. And I should put this light on. Before. Um, yeah, if um, people have high expectations for that game, of course, the hope is that it'll prove as fun to play as this one. And speaking of, let's start a new save. And yeah, I, I tried this game on hard, but that makes even the most basic enemies absolute bullet sponges. So let's go with story mode. Mm -hmm. Actually, I feel like this is one of the games I have seen way too many traders of. Commence briefing. Data on the subject, Kadir Suleiman, a local political figure hired to maintain order after the outbreak. His brother Hassan died in a disease-related incident before we were able to evacuate him. Suleiman blamed the GRE for Hassan's death. He stole a highly sensitive file which became his bargaining chip against the GRE, with instructions to publicize it if anything happened to him. Data on the subject, the stolen file. Yep, it details the incomplete process of synthesizing a cure for the virus. If implemented in its current state, the produced substance may be extremely toxic. Now. Also, the file contains full description of the Varian structure. Any attempt to use it would result in countless lives lost. It must be recovered. Further information, current status. Suleiman sent the file to an associate unknown to us, with instructions to publicize it at his command at any time. To counter that, we instituted a citywide communication jam, preventing him from publicizing the file. Your GRE-issued radio can overcome that jamming. It is your lifeline. Do not lose it. Suleiman has since gone underground and begun using a different name. We have reason to believe he now leads one of the two main factions operating within the city. You are to find Suleiman and locate the stolen file in order to save mankind from a disaster of unprecedented proportions. Yeah, if you were going down at this speed with a parachute, there's something wrong with the chute. I told you that wasn't a normal drop chute. Break his legs, then take him to rise. Back up! All of you! Stop! Loud noises draw them. Fall back! Fall back!
Tower. This is Jade. Get sick bay ready. Got a guy with a bad head wound and a bite on one arm. Oh shit, Amir's hurt? No. Amir is gone. But I'm bringing in someone who might still survive. One of us? We'll see. Yeah, that's a start, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, all I know, thing I know about Dying Light is, yeah, zombies. Yeah, basically, this game is uh, Dead Island, but better. The what? Yeah, Dead Island. Uh, there was uh, a zombie game oh. that came out before this. I, I quite enjoyed it, but... Uh, it, it's the one with the uh, the trailer that makes it seem mo so much more emotional uh, than it actually was. Wait, what? I thought it was a... Now I'm trying to... <laughs> I'll show it to you oh. after this. Yeah. I think I remember that island just... I think I made mixed up in another game then, again, where they just... You can build a chainsaw spear from paws and all that. Yeah, that is one of the... Th no, actually, that is Dead Rising, I think. Yeah. The one with take, which takes place mostly in malls. All right. You, you hear the problem there with some zombie games now. Yeah, right? th there's just so many Dead X games. Yeah, and, it, and with these games, there's another problem. There's Dead by Daylight, The Lost Light, and... Uh, Dying light. Yeah. So, Dead and light are very often used. He blinked. What? He blinked again. Really what if he's a zombie? Help! Zombie! Run! Help! 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 What the heck is? <sighs> I still have to say, these graphics are very nice. Then yeah, again, look... I typically don't care for graphics much, un except if they just look nice. They, you don't have to make go for ultra-realistic or something. Yeah, as, as long as it looks good and good story, it should be fine. And like I said, this hyper-realism doesn't equal good game. Yeah, the more power goes to the graphics, the less power goes to the gameplay. Yeah, and also can lead to much other problems. And what the heck is going on? It's yep. shaky as heck. Okay, a Discord must be screwing up somehow. No, no it, was, it was shaking on the menu. Then they can't see, it's it was just really fine. Like but now it's shaky again. Off to a great start. In paradise, can't you see? Okay, enough joking around. Head to room 190. Russell Creek. What do you mean, 31? Ask the boss. Yeah, the voice acting can be a bit hit or miss. That's your number. Excuse it me. It seems to be a You're the 31st infected. I'm the 18th. Everything is counted here. It is unnerving to watch. One more new infected. One more runner gone. Wait. It's kind of odd. Normally at this time I could expect it to have any pixelated and stuff, but... No, no. No pixelation. It looks clean. Just... Shaky. Okay. Uh, let's see. Might be that the graphics are set a bit too high on this. So um, that Discord having... The, if that was the case, then we would expect Discord have, would have a lot of uh, pixelation issues instead. Let's see, I'm looking for... Um, Eye tracker? Hmm. I, I've heard... I've not, I might actually look into that at some point. Uh, it doesn't seem that we can change subtitles or anything in here. Maybe it's in... Oh, there it is. Oh, 
Yeah, okay. Subtitles. Here's the thing. The subtitle seems all fine. Yeah, it's. But it's... Okay. Okay. Subtitles is fine. Problem is, it everything else is shaky. Okay. Let me like, take a quick look. Oops. You are shaking. Uh, let's it's, see. That's OBS. How? Come on, show that. Hmm. And why did it? Okay, this, the game suddenly went windowed mode and then not. Uh, sorry for this, people. Yeah, never seen us have this problem. Is it stable no, now? No. Let's see. And what exactly? Uh, Just everything is shaking or something? The text is fine, but... Yeah, it's sh sh weirdly shaky. What the heck is going on? I have no idea. And you are? Crane. Uh, 31. Oh, right. Um, how's your head? My head? Got it. Listen up. Until the boss says so, you are not on the list. So go talk to him ASAP and let's get things moving. Now, if you'll excuse me. Uh, it's almost like everyone is possessed on my screen. <laughs> Including you. I'm looking for the boss. Is he in there? Oh, you're 31. Go on in. Yep. You want to, I'm gonna try something. Actually, let's gonna... take a look here. I'm gonna restart on my end. Gamma. I think there is a bit of. I think there is head shake in this somewhere, but let's see if I can. Turn that off. You think it may it might show me had the head shaking? More than it should. And uh, let's see, what the heck is that? Hmm. It might be something that can only be done in or turned on or off in the main menu. Yeah, if if that's the case then uh, it might be worth doing for yeah, if, if you can imagine the problem for my brain, if it keeps doing this. Yeah, let's get through this part and then look if that can be changed. Hey, I'm looking for the... Are you the boss? What, am I too young? You got the problem with my age? No, I... You wanted to talk to me? That's better. Do you remember anything? Know what you are? Yeah, I can, I can see this is some kind of shelter. We call it the Tower. Brecken and his runners put it all together a couple of months ago, and we've been here ever since. Hunting airdrops, scavenging, and rescuing people. Yeah, I, I wanted to thank that girl. Good, because if not for her, you'd already be chewing somebody's knee bone. Your antigen was totally crushed, by the way. Only thing Jade could salvage was your radio. Oh, great. So can I get that back, please? Actually, I think I need it more than you do. Believe me, pal, that's not the case. Fine. Take it. You know my runners put their lives in danger? For guys like you. So now you take the antigen meant for someone else, and you won't even share your gear with us? I don't have time to deal with your bullshit. I've lost contact with one of our guys thanks to the fucked up radios we're stuck with. Do something for me, would you? I don't want to see you or your precious radio anymore. So go be useful somewhere else. We don't tolerate lazy assholes here in the tower. Hey, be fair. I'm not I'm not lazy. I'm just hey, boss. Save it. That last guy I mentioned, he's only on the 13th floor, but he might as well be trapped in a mine cave. Come back later. And I'm not the boss. Too young, remember? I'm Rahim. Brecken's in charge here. Okay, part of the... Is it really shaky or something? Because there, there it is head movement. Easy. Little shit. It's like that, there's a camera shaking going on non-stop. Okay. But in the earlier cutscene, it was flawless. But in the first menu in here, it's just going nuts. And now we actually get pixelated. <laughs> of course. 
Uh, hey. I'm always getting nausea from this. The 13th floor. I'm getting some stuff for Raheem. Thirteen. Shit. There's gonna be some dirty work. But we all got to pull our weight around here, huh? Okay, it should save here. Keeping an eye out for the save token or image. Jesus, how many people died here? Intact. No contact with the tower's leader yet. Unable to confirm identity. I'm taking steps to blend in. Acknowledged. Time is of the essence, Crane. Remember that. There's, there's one more thing. I, I got bitten. I've shown no symptoms, but the people here say I'm infected. Then you'd better get your hands on some antisem ASAP. Help! Hadn't you? Help! Somebody! What the hell? Uh, there's the save token icon. Okay, so quit. Let's see, options. It's the same, it seems. Hmm. Let's put that off. That might help. Uh, I don't know what the hell that is, but I, let's put it off as well. V-Zinc is always off. And let's drop that a bit. Is there anything else? Hints, swap weapon. Hmm. Now the, the head movement is part of the game, similar to like a uh, you know, Dead Island and Mirror's Edge. But it shouldn't be extre as extreme as you are saying. Yet, but I did meet this kid named Rahim. There's a sister Jade and her boyfriend Amir who saved my sorry ass. Yeah, that's a bit more info than we'd <laughs> gotten so far. Uh, yeah, the, the writing can be a bit wonky at times, but overall, this is a good game. And if they manage to improve on that a lot in Dying Light 2, then yeah, then I look forward to streaming that. Yeah, and we still have fixed it now. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, uh, we fixed it. For that all the work will look just horrible, maybe puke due to all the earlier shaking, but it seems to fix it. Okay, I remember that guy taking a few more hits, I think. My memory is, uh, of course, it's always shaky. You said you tried it on hard mode and the only story mode now. Yeah, I think this. I th I swapped it to normal mode on the last second. Oh, all right. And uh, yeah, this plays also something. You can see your own feet, which is something I will always praise in a game. That you're not just a float pair of floating arms. <sighs> I cut my arm, getting away from him. No oh, God, you had to kill him, didn't you? God damn it! That was... That was my brother. I came down to see him and... Easy, easy. It's all right now. I'll, I'll get help. Hey, Raheem, this is Crane. I'm down here on 13. Listen, this guy of yours got fucked up pretty bad getting away from a zombie. Oh, shit. 31? You went at their mark? Is it... Is it safe down there? Yeah, well, it's safe enough now. Okay, don't move. I'm sending Lena downstairs. Yeah, as you can see, everything went absolutely to shit in this place. Like, there, there isn't a square meter that ha doesn't have some blood on it. Hey, hold still. Bloody Lena dick. will be here any minute. Gauze. You've got to find some gauze. Oh, and alcohol. Oh. Oh, Combine them. So that will stop the bleeding. <laughs> Please hurry. I try to stay calm, okay? I'll be right back. 
Okay, now it's just weird. I do not want to know what that is. Fine. What? I do not want to know at all what that is in the tub. I don't know why. That looks rusty. That's the The gameplay seems to be working just fine without shaking in that manner, but as quick as you have a cut, you know, like you, when you talk to him, then it returns. Okay, odd. Hmm. Yeah, very odd. Yeah, if, if we end up streaming this game at some point, we'll have to. <clears throat> We'll have to look into some other screen sharing program then. Unless it also does the same with that. Yeah. I, I will try to just uh, restart it on my end to rejoin and see if that helps, but... You hear yourself, it sounds a bit too odd to be Discord. Yeah, it might be in the game itself, because we haven't had troubles like that with any other games. Exactly, and if it was on Discord's end, it would be on everything, not only yeah. on that and that. Yeah, then maybe we'd have to limit, maybe you, maybe we'd, yeah, we'd have to go without you being able to provide fire. live commentary. This a shot. Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh. Okay, did this all of this <laughs> go over or something? I need to craft one med kit uh, there. Okay. And there we go. Uh, yeah, let's go back to him before he actually bleeds out. Okay, that is more than just okay, a cut. He's, he's bleeding pretty bad. Let me see him. Gauze and alcohol, huh? Pretty primitive, but it'll work. Thanks for the help. I'll take care of him from here. What does he return for the these things that I'm shaking? <laughs> and all stops. Yeah, that. Well done, thirty-one. <laughs> okay, what's with your tiger camo pants? Uh, well, yeah, that looked more like a an a, a chunk was taking out. Not bad for a new guy. Yeah. Perhaps I misjudged you. Yeah, I just want to help out and repay you guys for what you did for me. Well, good. Come find me, and we'll talk about how you could do that. Okay, back up we go. Hmm. I, is it shaking when I stand still like this? Nope. The, the text is no longer lagging and all that, so you have partially fixed it. He even moves without lagging. Now the lagging is only on the... Yeah, the scenes where you talk to someone. Okay. Odd. And when... Okay, now we returned. When you open the door. Alright, taken care of. Piece of cake. What else you got for me? Well, let me think. Rahim, you are just smart what? enough to be dangerous, yeah. you know that? Omar told me about your plans for the nest. Explosive charges? Really? What? Explosives? Oh, never please. Said that. You can't tell a convincing lie to save your life. I know what I'm doing. Yeah? You think you can't die? You're not my mom. No, I'm not. Our mom's dead. So you might want to be a little nicer to me since I'm the only family you have left. Especially now that Amir is gone. You're Jade, right? Right. I just wanted to thank you for what you did for me and, and tell you how sorry I am for your loss. I owe you and Amir my life. Yeah, you do. You want to return the favor? Keep my dipshit brother from killing himself. No explosives, Rahim. The heck is with this shaking? Yeah, if it's too much, then uh, you can end the screen share on your end, I think. So, so, is that enough? Do I get to talk to Brecken now? First, I can... go change your clothes. Mm. I left some new ones for you in your room. You're in 194. Something wrong with what I'm wearing? 
You need something that fits the job Brecken wants you to do. Call me when you've changed. Let's see, if I say this actually happening on the stream as well, that could be a bigger problem then. I hope not. It doesn't seem to be on the st stream, or at least on OBS. Uh, did my sound just die? Okay, headset isn't giving audio. Is voice meter up to stuff again? Uh, there you go. I found yes, it your is. stream. Okay, reconnect that. And that. Yep, there we go. Okay, test one, two, three. Three, four, five. And. Um... Oh, my PlayStation is just being dumb at the moment. Okay, the, the, yeah, the audio program I use to split Discord and game audio, it sometimes loses connection with my headset for some reason. Alright, and now I'm uh, watching it on my TV here a little bit on side to see how it behaves. Uh, so some dumb things from this is like, if you're going to send someone into a zombie infested area, uh, well, where he landed was probably just playing dumb luck, but you'd think you'd at least put someone down in something that'd be bite proof. Yeah. And beyond that, uh, we can <laughs> I'm not sure if the mask got knocked off or something, but you'd think people would have been asking questions like, uh, why did you parachute in here? Okay, this is our basically our bank of stuff. Uh, yeah, we have some extra stuff here. <laughs> Ninja outfit, special agent outfit, urban explorer outfit. Uh, let's go with that just for fun. <laughs> Okay. Uh, something about the voice acting. It, may, it might just be that I'm too unfamiliar with uh, the accents of people that I uh, that I judge the. That I judge yeah. the uh, voice acting to be uh, worse than it actually is. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm no expert. Yeah, sometimes it gets hard to know if that's a proper way to treat the accent or not. Raheem, I don't see you. Where are All you? Right, I've compared here. Oh, it's funny on the screen, but somehow it could be totally get hard. Okay, Parker Basics, space to jump, look at the lads you want to grab, like that. And yeah, similar to Mirror's Edge, how fast you're going and how high you can get up to somewhere, uh, the quicker you can grab on and such. So how the hell did he get across to this, uh, <laughs> to this building so fast if he is in here? Because he he just turns the he just turned the crane to there here. So is there another is there a bridge between these or something? Not visible from this side, or this angle. Welcome to our gym. First things first, you've got to learn how to run. What do you mean learn how to run? Just do what I say. All right. Now, jump down to the very bottom. You nuts! I'd kill myself. Don't be a wimp. Come on, you can't be serious. Watch this. Ah! Ah, Raheem, my leg. Jesus, don't move. I'll get help. Ah, I was just fucking with you. Son of a bitch. What? You can't take a joke. Come on. 
Get your ass down here. Christ on a crutch. <laughs> Yeah, for some reason, garbage bags in this universe are uh, oh, the straw shit. bales. Holy shit! <laughs> it's a rush, isn't it? But don't blow your load just yet. There's more. To survive outside, you got to take advantage of the terrain. Most eaters suck at climbing, so the harder the terrain is, the better for you. I've got some typical situations set up for you. Let's see how you handle them. <laughs> yeah, I get no more confirmation. The this yeah again that comes up during these speech cuts to screens, it seems, only appears on Discord. Sometimes it's and better to crawl through the lone really will have a tough time following you. It appears to only come up on infinite to, to be counted as a scene, like when you want to open a door or crawl over a thing. Okay. But when you're just playing the game regularly, it's normal. Outside, if you stop, you're probably dead. Not oh, bad. Really bad. For a noob. Okay, down. Uh, are we supposed to go down? No. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah, there's... Yeah, generally, yellow is uh, where to go. That half rhymes. Get up on that scaffold and don't fall because there sure as hell ain't no net. That's my favorite. Cat grab and muscle up. You won't survive outside for 10 minutes if you can't do that. That's grabbing. Then we can jump over here. And there we go. Okay, can't grab onto that. Can we... We can't get up to that. Let's see. Okay, these planks are specifically put there to mess with us, I think. Um, okay... Oh, so they they want us to use this, okay. <laughs> and the case of me overlooking the obvious. Okay. Now, can we get onto here? We can. I ever came to this was running track in high school. Huh. Well, then you're a fucking prodigy. Never seen anything like it. Hmm. Yeah, then I think about it again. You, unless, unless Crane. Oh. What's happening to me? Crane, shit. Shit. Oh, shit. Crane, talk to me. What's going on? Something went wrong. Raheem, what just happened to me? Yep, uh, I actually forgotten that was real, <laughs> really a thing. Yeah, we need to get Anderson quick. And okay, that's actually a, an unintentional. Uh, <clears throat> oh, uh, no, <laughs> don't get that close. Raheem, what the fuck was that? Does this mean I'm, I'm turning? Most likely no. At least not yet. Seizures remind you that you're infected. You better go see Dr. Zera though. He'll check you out, probably give you a shot of Antizen. Before you head out to see Zera, talk to the Quartermaster. He'll uh, gear you up so you can go outside without getting your head bitten off. Uh, a bit of unintentional overlap between this game and the other is, yeah, you both in both games, you get uh, occasional seizures that you have to get, well, an, a medicine for. Okay. Yeah, I, I 
I'd actually completely forgotten about it, and All at right. least we're giving me an actual job, and nobody suspects I'm not who I say I am. So far, so good. And once Doctor Zara helps me manage these symptoms I'm dealing with, I'll be even better. But yeah, what I was going to say before the seizure is that did Crane skydive in fucking casual wear or something? Because I'm pretty sure that wouldn't go too well. Well, he had a helmet by the looks of things earlier that got cracked. Yeah, it, it, it probably got uh, knocked away during the beating that he got, but he didn't have a suit on or anything. Because I'm pretty sure having clothes flapping around everywhere during a skydive would be not good. Because that would... I don't know how much force would be needed to bruise skin, but uh, at terminal velocity, I think cloths could get that. <laughs> yeah, something feel, does feel odd. Yeah, just a bit video gameiness of such. Maybe they'll keep that. Maybe they'll uh, think things through a bit more in the sequel. Yeah, it's one of these I know they're usually not sloppy with. Oh, you're the new scout. Rahim radioed me about you. Yeah, that's me. Name's Crane. I'm not gonna bother learning your name till you survive a few days, but here, this is for you. By the way, word around the tower is you're just another deadbeat in line for food on Antizy. By which I mean... The people here don't much like you, but don't blame them. It's easy to get paranoid when you're isolated. And since somebody's jamming communications to the outside, there's plenty of paranoia to go around. Whole damn city with nobody to call for help but ourselves. You bring me some supplies from the airdrops, though, and you'll see people change their tunes in a hurry. That shit's a game changer. Uh, thanks. I'll bear that in mind. Listen, is there anything else? I'm in a bit of a rush. Also, if you're looking to get more popular, you can try helping folks. Do a few favors, they might like you more. Might even find a woman. Keep you warm at night. <laughs> okay, bit exposition-y. Let's see, some metal parts, a med kit, and a lock pick. Lock picks will be useful. Uh, yeah, he has quite a bit of stuff back here, the entire crates. Th these are the supply drops that we'll be finding every now and then. Actually, let me turn this light down. It's making me look like a freaking ghoul. Uh, yeah, there's enough light coming out from outside already. Uh, yeah, the supply crates that we'll be uh, going after from time to time. These will get dropped down at random times, I think. Uh, med kits, of course, always useful. Especially so in a zombie outbreak. I can't tell what that is. I, I tried to re... Let's see. ST stir. Yeah, too much of the top is covered to get a good reading of it. And just miscellaneous uh, pills and stuff. Battle journal. Okay. Okay. Yes, yeah, as, as a lot of games have in these times, there's collectibles all over the place. People like, yeah, that, that makes sense. Some people like are almost made to be made as clubs. Uh, let's see, this is downstairs. Oh yeah, this place is well defended, I'll give them that. Each, each area, or most areas, uh, are not really hard to get into, but definitely uh, well defended at, at the very least for your size. Hmm? Okay, new guy, be careful out there. We've lost too many already. Also smart, of course, to just lock the freaking door. <laughs> yeah, if you can lock it, lock it. Crane, kid. All right, all right. Crane. Just keep moving. There's no time to take in the sights. Yeah. And try not to make too much noise. So, 
And here we go. The usual enemies, or the most common enemies, the walkers. Yep. And um, here's the funny thing I think about the pipe weapons in games. And that's well, I see in the, the huge collection of how many variations there are. And in this situation, I would say if you you know on survival. Situation against zombies, just collect as many parts as possible, but you could make a hammer out of them. And by that, I mean an actual damn hammer. Let's see. This should probably feel smooth with the swing with. And that looks. Uh... Yeah, there. There's some big ass sores on these, uh. X people. Yeah, but I can already say from this is this is not a kids game. <laughs> you think? Oh, someone just lost their job. How are you? Oh wait, was that a kill shot on that one? You know how people can be at times about games. Yeah. But if you if you're gonna ignore half naked zombies that are basically showing the goods then yeah you are not paying attention this is supposed to be an 18 plus game <laughs> or 16 plus at least yeah i i'd say that the uh vicious beating from before <laughs> and the fact that's had have been had have been popping would also be a good indicator remember you're looking to someone that watched rusty park when he was six years old or something without being faced <laughs> but yeah, you might be right there. Doctor? Hello? Anybody there? Camden, are you there? Dead. Uh, so I'm supposed to get a vaccine? What? No, no. Suppressant. It's called Antizen. Suppresses the symptoms. Here, sit. Antizen postpones the inevitable. Guess the GRE could do. Inevitable, so th there's no cure? It's a variation of rabies. There's no cure right now, but you see, I've been running tests on both antizen and infected tissue. A cure is possible, definitely possible. Oh shit, you really think you can figure it out? With Dr. Camden's help, yes, I think so. Uh, where did I put that injector? And who's Dr. Camden? A colleague trapped in Sector Zero. Where the outbreak first, well, broke out. We've been collaborating via radio. Though we would have made more progress if the connection were better. Also, if my earlier experiments had borne fruit. I tried injecting recombined versions of the virus into chunks of meat and leaving them around the city. Hoping some of the infected would eat them so I could observe and document the results but they didn't uh, it bore no fruit i'm ashamed that i wasted so much time on it no reason to hold any antizen in reserve now in any case all right i'm quite busy so on your way now what was i doing yeah he's a bit scatterbrained would you blame him with uh, this this situation? Zero nope. took me out and gave me another shot. Okay, great. Not on to hold you for a while, which is good. Cause I'm starting to get used to the idea of bossing you around. So, time for a real trial. Go talk to Spike. You'll find him near Zeta's truck. He's got the first real job for you. And yeah, this is why there's so many athletic people around in the town. <laughs> this all broke out during basically the uh, parkour Olympics. Which means there were probably plenty of people to teach others how to do it. Yep. That job from Spike over here. Hey Spike, I'm Crane. Just what I need. More unskilled labor. All right. Shut up and pay attention. There are two types of airdrops. One is food, first aid supplies, survival gear and such. 
The other kind is filled with antizen. The GRE sends in a one-way video feed that lets us know when they're on the way. But the trouble is, the airdrops with antizen keep getting raided by Rise's thugs. And without antizen, we're basically screwed. Rise and his boys only operate during the day, because going out after dark is a dandy way to get killed. But the next two antizen drops are coming down right at sunset tonight, and Brecken means to go after them. This may be our only chance to reach the airdrop. What's my part here? Well, as I said, going out at night is basically suicide. Or it would be if I hadn't been setting up safe zones and traps out there for weeks now, which I have. Now, Brecken and his team will be okay tonight so long as you get out there now and arm those traps. That's your part. All right. What are these traps and how do I arm them? You'll see. I'll be talking you through it. Just remember, without these traps, Brecken won't survive the night. And if he doesn't come back with Antizen, we are lost. Before you head out there, grab some firecrackers. Made them myself. They make a fine distraction if you get in trouble. Let's see. Tab it. Okay. I <laughs> I didn't actually know about this, probably because I never really used it. But uh, yeah, we have our weapons here. And oh wait, is this what we have selected? Hold. Oh, tab is for weapons up to four that you have can, can have equipped. And one swaps through equipment, uh, though we only have the fire trackers at the moment, so it's not switching to anything. And yeah, basically loot, loot, loot. Bloody heck. Yeah, during these the times, if I were in this situation, I would be asking people to help me gather materials and I would arm them to the teeth. <laughs> yes, as a kid, I. It was kind of a hobby to make wooden weapons or just improvising weapons. And yeah, this isn't. They aren't. These people aren't technically dead. It's just, yeah, a varies of, variant of rabies. Uh, and let's see. You know, there is something it's probably more correct to say undead. Yeah. Since the, yeah, you, you saw the condition of some of them. Yeah, the human body can survive through a lot, especially if the metabolism gets slowed down. Yeah, but... They use a method to make sure we can survive as well. And they I don't think they, those are able to just burn the lump missing. Um, I'm outside, working for Spike. Alright, I'm on it. Let's see, further north, okay. Uh, yeah, during most of this you want to stick to rooftops and such. Uh, yeah, the survivor site will help us identify stuff that we can uh, grab. Oh, hello there. Bye-bye. Uh, yeah, I see, I see you want to stick to the rooftops and immediately I go down to the ground. Oh, hello. Yeah, these parts we can use to make I make weapons or upgrade weapons. Bye-bye. Uh, let's see. Yep, second entrance. Ooh, blades are good. Let's see. Uh, if you want to go in somewhere, check if there is at least another exit. Because if, if yeah, if they were following me now, I'd be uh, trapped in here. I'd have to fight my way out, like such. Bye bye. Oh, uh, hello, everybody. <laughs> Any way to get across, or am I going to have to bolt? Cell phone. Yeah, these walkers, at the very least, they... Okay, well, then we need to climb up there. And that... Could I use the cable? Don't want to risk that being electrified. 
You said you said walkers. Yeah. Does that mean there are other types of zombies in this? Of course there are. Uh, of course. I was just have to double check in case uh, you did uh, accidentally go uh, walking dead referencing. Yep. Yep. You, I, I appreciate that I can actually call them zombies. Yeah. No weird meaning. You just exactly not just what they are. Yeah, but many of these zombie uh, games and shows they play it. Like, uh, in-universe, there has never been zombie media or such. Yeah, uh, but in this one, it's clear that I have. I'm not sure. And, uh, there we go. And they did call them zombies several times already, so... Okay. It should be proof enough. Now, I think they've been calling them eaters more. And let's take that. Yes. Yes, they seem to have a nickname in for them, but I did hear them call them zombies at some point. Her run weekly, time to elect our future, president to candidate, and why is it Hamad? Okay, that's a, a leading <laughs> yeah, headline. Oh, hello. <laughs> Prehistoric overkill. Replay that, please. And move. Be quick or be dead. Someone made a prophetic cover. Uh, miss. Can you see what I'm talking about? This is the alarm. Okay, just to <laughs> casually grope the dead. Yeah, I have to say there, watch where you put your hands. But yeah, I, I know that even if you have a slow metabolism, if you lose an arm like that, it, it's gonna bleed out. Yeah. When a few animals we could survive that, and yeah, one of the animals that could survive something huge, bite wounds or not, are actually dinosaurs. Yeah, because there's just so much flesh. Uh... Yeah. That and they all eat with the heat quite well and Gigi, quickly. I'm here, along with some infected. Watch yourself, Chris. There we go. And yeah, we have stat we have limited stamina for this. So combat in generally is oh yeah, you you want to be careful with it. Yeah, I kinda like people to like stamina system in games. As long as don't balance and well, that you understand that Yeah, just in real life fight, just don't go full ham. You need to conserve your energy. Tie yourself out too fast and yeah, you're good at stand. Yeah. So I think in... Okay, think that's a bad room, sound. So yeah. I think there's a part in the game from you to it. Too far. Alright. Finish it. Just don't let him suffer. Yeah, here we have the second type. The infected. What happened to this? Okay, it's done. Fuck. You had no choice. He wasn't human anymore. Now hurry. You still need to turn on the lights. That's the only way to make this place safe at night. Yeah, the infected are called such because they are the recently infected or the recently turned. All so right. basically, if we turn, that's us. Okay, so they are. Oh, shit. They get less deadly the longer they go. They are undead. Got the lights on? It depends. Uh, almost. Just give me a second. But yeah, it, it's basically that rigor mortis starts to set in, somewhat. Uh, not really sure if rigor mortis is the right term, but yeah, the 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 body starts to uh, stiffen and such. So you could call it rigor mortis, even though they. Technically, are still alive. If early, if they are even technically, at this time of time, I feel like it's better staying undead. For if it is like rabies, which means virus, the virus is this is my the one controlling it. Report. Okay, I met this doctor, scientist type. They've got him set up in a sort of research trailer, and he's working on a cure for the virus. His name is Zera. Hello. Do you copy? Affirmative. Secondary objective added. Maintain your cover and secure all of his research. Acknowledge. You 
stolen file still takes top priority though, right? Affirmative. We find it unlikely that a single researcher working out of a trailer could produce any significant results. But if he does, we want to see it. Yeah, big ass blue filter. <laughs> Is it me? Is there something weird with the bird? Infected are all over the street. So what does that tell you? Keep off the street. Try to stay on the rooftops where they can't reach you. Oh. They're all around the car, Spike. You still have some firecrackers, don't you? Just throw some into the crowd. Those dead bastards are easily distracted. There we go. We use middle mouse button for that. And yeah, <laughs> like a like a flock of ducklings, they just chase after. And now they're all stacked up on there. Okay, over there. But yeah, the, the infected, they are still fresh, so to say. So yeah, they, they are faster, but they are also a lot more squishy. Okay, quick, quick, quick. Uh, all of you head over there. Come on. All done with the car, Spike. Keep on like that, you just might make it. The next trap's still spot. I should never tell you. Don't get caught out in the open. Spike, these freaks are everywhere. If I need to use a trap, how do I activate it? Hello. Uh, yeah, this, this game might not be the best to, uh, the most pleasant to look at. It sometimes, especially with uh, how fast movements are at times. Yeah. Oh, hello. And yeah, I people could get nauseous from that. Yeah, and I can imagine that the, there's been so many YouTube streaming this, all playing this. Uh, and also, you see that everything is almost like a unicolor. It is, as you said, when you get, everything goes fast, it gets harder to see what's going on. It's quite a contraption you got here. Three times brighter than an ordinary street lamp. Gives the infected quite the sunburn. Oh, oh hello. I uh, didn't notice this was your little hiding spot, and. Okay. <laughs> uh. Let's just ignore that. Oh, hello. Hmm. Yeah, that won't explode on its own, though. Uh, wait, hold on. Let's take a moment here. Is there another way up there? Or how did that damn thing get in there? Hey. Yeah, if if people had been working on that, uh, then that would have should have been cleared out already. So, uh, yeah, I small little oversight out. with the spawning. I, I saw the stairs over there on the side of the building. So they all stepped up to that room. Okay, uh, we're on the hour mark, but let's at least finish this mission. And then head back to a safe, a safe zone. Okay. Ah, this place. This is a big open one. Oop, and I missed someone there. And yeah, night is falling. Skill point gets. Yeah, as you can see at the top there, we have two sorts of levels. We have agility and combat. 
And oh. let's see. Ah, uh, here. Yeah. 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 opens this. Oh. And Gesundheit. Thank you. We have our overall rank. We have agility, power, and legend, which is basically a uh, prestige ish, or once you've okay. filled everything else out. Mm. That's. That's been a while I sneezed on the stream. <laughs> okay, maybe... dodge. Yeah, dodge. All right. <laughs> and what can we get here? Supporting abilities, blueprints, and gadgets. Quests help other, yeah, basically questing. Uh, survival can't, lock picks, yeah, basically the standard stuff that we can make. And now we can dodge some. Nope. <laughs> now we can dodge our ass into a warehouse. Well done. Some loot in here. Come on, what is this? A water pipe. But uh, I think we're, our inventory is full-ish. What the heck? Why you again? And there's our power level. Okay, yeah, face your friends directly. Stun. Each strike with a blunt weapon has a chance to stun. Stun is always good. What's in here? Some string, and that's it. And yeah, we have a flashlight that we can activate with T. I remember that because I've been playing this game again recently, or rather the DLC, which I hadn't actually finished yet. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's see, there and there. Okay, once the arm is let go, that's to show that you can jump. Okay, lights are all set. You ready for the next one then? Better hurry. Yeah, I, I definitely would not like falling into just bags of that because for all you know there could be metal or, or glass in there. Yeah. Like the whole goddamn district went down. What the hell's going on? Um, not again. All right, listen. There's a power substation here. Go check it out. Okay, that way. Did he just send you and accidentally made you do a power overlook over entire district? Okay, come on. It's, uh, where is this? Yeah, oh, sorry for that little movement. Ah, here. What the? Yeah, this is what happens to some if. Once the infection progresses far enough. Oh, I still got hit. Yeah, the dodge isn't an invincibility move. If you get hit, you're still getting hit. Okay, big boy. Move. Luckily enough, running doesn't drain stamina. And our weapon is ineffective, so let's go with this one. <laughs> we got this one anyway, so we might as well use it. Wait, what? Did he just pull a hat up against you? 
Yep. And yeah, you can see how beefy this guy is on normal modes. Okay. <laughs> and there we go. Yoink. Yeah, as you can see on the wrist rods, it's getting late. Uh, Oh, uh, sorry for disturbing you. And yeah, what we were looking for wasn't in that junction box, or however you would call any of these. Yeah, so sometimes we have to look around to find the right one. All right, I've got the substation reset, but if the grid shorted once, you know it could happen again, right? Okay, that's just, that's just playing creepy with the eyes open like that. <laughs> okay. With these lockpicks, you have to be a bit careful. What is that? Yep. Uh, let's have a quick look. Inventory, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. I think I recognize one of the cigarette brands there. Uh, let's see. Yeah, inventory management is going to be a bit of a thing. So let's just re let's just pull a few of these apart and equip some other ones. And let's keep the rebar just for now. Uh, but yeah, we need to get out of here because it's getting dark. Oh, uh, hello. Uh, <laughs> swing and a miss, big time. But yeah, we'll finish this mission, then we'll head for Far Cry 2. And we'll give that a full hour and extra if needed as well. Oh, uh, <laughs> jumped over someone there. Through the shanty town. Yep, and miss. <laughs> okay, once you do get a flow with this, it do, it can be really fun to just hop all over town. I probably should keep something less big in my hands. Supposedly you can swing it. Oh, uh, hello. Uh, uh, that's not a way to <laughs> welcome a guest. Then again, this isn't the way to treat our host. Some more string. Household supplies. Yeah. The household supplies and stuff won't be useful to us, but we can sell it. Because, of course... Uh, Here comes the uh, thing again. Uh. The fuck is that? Hey, Doc. It's Kyle Crane. Crane! What can I do for you? I just saw this freaking weird zombie. He's covered in big green blisters. It, it hauled ass as soon as it spotted me. You know anything about it? <laughs> Not enough information, I'm afraid. But if you see another one, Also, something uh, to explain. Um, 
with those lights and such. So you might be asking why some of those zombies might just get in here and start banging on the door. That's because these places have been lined up with UV lights. And uh, yeah, one of the signs of rabies is, well, sensitivity to light. Yes. Or sunlight at the very least, I think. Oh, blueprint. Okay, okay. And yeah, we can use these safe houses to wait until morning or until night. So. Okay, give me a sec. Uh, choose your experience. Complete the prologue. I'm ready to survive and die. The corrupt challenges are enabled. Hmm. Yeah, let's go off. We're, we're going to call it here anyways. And yeah, something bad happening. Content drop number five. Prison heist. Okay. Yeah, I... They have been updating this game for quite a bit long. Wait. 2014. Was this game released in 2014? Could be. It, I know it's not 10 years old, at the very least, I think. Not yet, at least. But I think I, I know that the game is old, and I thought many times they were about to release it, but I guess they've just been releasing. DLC is an expansion to it a lot. Now there is only one big expansion, and this is a bit of a, a glaring weakness in this place's defense. But uh, yeah, as you can see here, UV lights. And those are especially useful during the night. <laughs> but that'll be that for now of this game, before I really make you seasick with all of the movement. Okay, and then we start up the second one. Yeah, hopefully that one works better. Okay, oh, first time setup. Yeah, I, I, I kind of rushed this a bit with in installing these uh, only today. Well, Dying Light I already had installed, but for I Cry 2 I had to install before this. Uh, yes, yes, agree. Okay, it's installing uh, some sort of anti-cheat, or going over some sort of anti-cheat. Okay. Yeah, this game has multiplayer, even though it, I'm pretty sure it is dead. Well, not really dead, dead, but you know where no one really plays it anymore. Come on. Is this going to be... I hope this isn't the case where if the anti-cheat can't be installed, that it can't be played. Okay, test completed. Okay, it can be installed like this. Because I'm pretty sure... Whatever service that was isn't on anymore. It's called Punk Busta. <laughs> because, of course. Let's see, how warm is it in here actually now? I have one of these big ass old time, you know, oldish uh, thermometers here, and according to this, it's 26 degrees in here. Oh, not that hot over here. So I'm getting skeptical over my a AC and wheels, because I keep, on, keep calling it that. Okay, screen share it if it wants to work. It needs to be windowed first, because of course. Uh, and it's in a absolutely tiny resolution now. Okay, options, game, node, and uh, yes, on subtitles. Uh, where are the yeah, display? And why the hell is it set so low? Okay, there we go. 
Let's put that to as high as can. Let's put the anti-aliasing up. Oh, let's leave that on nine then if it needs to restart. And let's put all of this on ultra high. But also uh, widescreen. Where is the windowed option for this? Yes, keep all of that. Let's see. Wait, is there no windowed option for this? Game. Hmm. No, I don't need to see that. Uh, <coughs> the product code. Hmm. Okay, yeah, I should have I should have checked these game. I should have checked this beforehand. Uh, let me do a quick search then. All right. Let's see. Come on. Far Cry 2. Window. Windowed mode. Also, uh, yesterday apparently Far Cry 6. Well, it doesn't. It wasn't announced, but uh, more was revealed about it at E3. Okay. I think I see some new 4K trailers of late, but they made me confused and wonder if there were DLC for the fifth one or not. Okay, there we go. Alt and Enter swaps it between uh, windowed and not. So there we go. Go live. OBS front again just to see if there's anything screwing up. I, I should keep that in mind. Alt Enter. See if that works with any other games to make it windowed and restore it. But yeah, now we can start the timer at about uh, 20 minutes. Yeah, yeah Far Cry 2. Uh, this game can't exactly be called great or amazing, but a lot of things in modern gaming did start here. Or start with this game and, well, the original Far Cry as well. Like you almost smacked your screen due to a young mosquito? <laughs> no. Let's see. Let's go for normal. And yeah, now we can we can collect. Yeah, we can select a character even though it doesn't actually have any effect. This is just more for a yeah personal choice, I think. It's a nationalized U.S. Brazilian. Wait. What the heck is that supposed to mean? Nationalized U.S. Uh, uh, that they immigrated to the uh, states and uh, became a citizen there. Ah, oh, alright, that word. It just never seen that wording before. C sixteen. Registered security permit, Florida. A a oh, experience. VIP protection. Yeah. These characters will show up in the game, but it, yeah, our our choice doesn't really make have any effect here. See, sing, Hippolyte, Ashaba, Builders, Buy. Uh, yeah, this okay. the last one. Okay, you get to pick the character. Okay, okay. Yeah, it it, do, it doesn't actually have anything more of an effect. Uh, <clears throat> then uh, yeah, the, this. It doesn't really have an effect on gameplay or anything, except maybe the the color of the skin that you see while during the healing animations and such. And I misread one of the last name. I thought uh, someone was called up the name Hippolyte, and I mis accidentally misread to, to Hippocrit. <laughs> yeah, that was where my head was going at first as well. Uh, you might as well start with the first character. Five minutes in this country and it's clear things are about to go very bad. The UFL, UFLL and the APR are gearing up for open fighting. My mission is simple, to kill the, the Jackal, the bastard that armed both sides. It wasn't long ago. Oh. <laughs> okay, we'll go. Hey, sir. Sorry for the delay. So you going to our hotel in Pala? Yeah, I know the place. It's lucky for you. Pala is only one hotel still working. Who? 
Yeah, from uh, one locked down area to another. Okay, uh, someone's jumping for joy. <laughs> boing, 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 boing. <laughs> was jumping, I realized, no, it's just his animation is on the bugged out. Yeah, this game is older than Dying Light by about 10 years, I guess. Uh, so yeah, jank is to be expected. Okay, water buffalo with <laughs> a bit uh, not only really polygony, but you could see the. Yeah, the flat surfaces on it. Yeah, but wait, hold on. I thought water buffaloes were wild and not domesticated. Hey, look at that. I see something to do so much with the fire. This fire's like a badass that thing. My brother has such a beautiful banga with a fire. Three kettle. Hey, he's a rich man. A brush fire destroyed everything. And now he left the country. Yeah, killed it. This is Liberation Radio. Speaking the truth for the truth seekers. And the truth is that your country needs you. Beware the evil APR scorch. A plague has gripped our people. They're not fans of the DJ. Maybe his music choices. Who knows? That's <laughs> a bouncy boy. And what about some of the checkpoints is all on it? I need a bunzan. <laughs> Where are you? My passenger, driving him to the hotel mm -hmm. in town. You come from the airport? Yes, sir, the airport. Uh, gentlemen, you are posted here all day. Now, on my way back, I grab some cold beer. You drink beer? Yep. Beer. We drink beer. Hurry up then. Move along. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. See you soon, sir. Yeah, mercenaries. Again, we are also playing a mercenary. Yeah, the mercenary understood truly about folk, right? How fictional is it? Uh, how what is it? Uh, they seem to be the same universe as ours, but at the same time, they usually are areas that have okay. never been heard of. Uh, ba basically, uh, fictionalized ca uh, countries to avoid uh, taking off any actual countries. Alright. Don't let this concern you, just boys letting off steam, right? Yeah, letting off steam, huh? Hey, 
don't look so cool. You tired? Oh well, game over. Oh, all right. We're safe, folks. Just same as before. Yep, that's the jackal. And you seriously have malaria? The couch, I mean. Yep. That is unique. And I think we have some bigger problems now. Here. Come on, fit through. Okay, standard to aim and shoot. Yeah, <laughs> shit is going down now. Yeah. Okay, he's not our problem anymore. Oh, fire. Yeah, fu This is the game where the Far Cry game started with the fire. And, uh, yeah. That's past block now. Oop, oop. Uh, that is a lot that are after us. Okay, at least the fire... Mostly died down here. Come on. Grab that. And dead. Okay, we weren't meant to survive that. I think it has been it has been over a decade since I last played this game. You safely escaped this ceasefire zone. <laughs> there was plenty of fire. Yeah, critically wounded. Must heal yourself, or you will die. And uh, yeah, soft stomachs. Look away. That was one of the uh, same but Who you working with? You got some of my guys killed at the hotel, you know that? So now you run errands for me, and I got some things for you to do. Get out here, take what you need. There's ammunition, medicine, whatever. Hurry up. Okay, blue case. And yeah, this is literally our safe box. <laughs> oh, 
Nu måste jag inte på. Okay. Ooh, hello. Beyond's okay. Four weapons with with the machete, primary, secondary, and specials. Yeah, <laughs> they started out with uh, the many many guns here. Wait, I'm confused. How is a rocket one-handed weapon? Now I think they meant more. It, the rockets launchers are among the special weapons. We can carry a primary, secondary, and a special. But on a secondary weapon, but something that looked like a rocket. And this guy's entrusting us with a flamethrower after we killed some. Well, after we killed one of his guys. Uh, the other uh, one can't be attributed to us. He just blew up on his own. Uh, no, no, no. I would be more concerned to give you a flamethrower just for being helium. There's enough reasons for that. Well, I'm pretty uh, sure yeah. you have an interesting history with flamethrowers. There was supposed to be ceasefire, but that's all out the window now. I worked for this big shot, Kumba, local boss for United Front. Everyone I've got knows us from hole in the ground is out in fields fighting the APR. That just leaves you, Aaron, boy. So first thing, you need to get piece of shit automobile back on road. You do that, or do you not know us from hole in the ground? Go outside and get the engine running. You know he got malaria, right? So you screw around, you pass out, maybe die. Too bad. God, open up. Okay, how the hell does he know that we have malaria? I, I'm not surprised that they've been uh, able to recognize malaria on site. Yeah, there's probably uh, some visual things on the skin. Uh, like discoloration and such. Uh, we can grab ammo. And yeah, we were hiding in a butcher shop. Let's see. Current objective. Uh, repair the car parked outside. We have our map here. And here. Right, be right back. I'm going to throw some food into the machine. Okay. Hard to change the scale from region to full. And okay, never mind. Local region and then what is this this should be the entire region and then this is more local okay yeah sprint basic it's a hold case uh, yeah <laughs> yeah this is not how you fix a car or at least not this easily. I kind of wonder why they picked uh, that healing animation earlier. But it sort of makes sense, but also not. Yeah, it, there's a. They have like two dozen of those, and some of them can get pretty uh, uh, squishy. But All that, right. That's only if you if you are at uh, low health. Yeah, <laughs> old as Nokia phones. Okay, yeah, that is very old. I, I barely remember when this came out. I would know that I have almost had zero input in what I... Yeah, I'd say that this game deserves a remake. Because even, even though it is janky, this is uh, where a lot of Far Cry stuff started. Mm. Far Cry 3 is reason enough not to need one. I, but they, maybe they could do a, a Far Cry remaster trilogy or something. I think they're all doing that or something. For there has been all the trailers about another Far Cry, then suddenly shows the other older ones. I'm wondering, wait, wasn't that already released a year ago? Why is it showing again along with new? See what is going on. Okay. 
Yeah, if, if this gets a remaster, I'd stream that at some point. Alright. I mean, he's got a computer, but I've been filming with another Far Cry. I think what they think in New York City is a bit confused. What are they? I don't know what they are to show in the trailers for them anymore. Okay, reload. Oh. I think nope. they've been going, doing the recent trailers in such a weird way that they're now just confusing. Okay, block this guy in. And that's him dealt with. Yeah, <laughs> not a pleasant way to go. I hear you clean that place up good. Okay, I've got another chore for you. But sick guy like you will be falling down in the middle of it. Go to sleep, get resupplied, and move out in a few hours. You're safe at house for now. Uh, safe? Uh, here comes my first critic system uh, on this game. And that is? And that's the subtitle. Hmm? Subtitle? Oh, oh subtitles. Yeah. They, when you, they speak to you here when you walk around, they are not the best... They don't have the best visibility. Yeah, it's a, a lot of browns with this game. To yeah. Upgrade and, by working with your buddies. And if you're going to have subtitles, it is, would be important to make them very readable. And I think many games from this era were very guilty of this crime. Like they have it, like now here, it's just clean. But when they speak to you, when something comes out, it's uh, just disappointment. And okay. kind of bad. And I imagine this is one of the games where having a subtitle is important so you don't miss out what they are saying. Let's see. Uh, let's go until six. I don't know if it's six a.m. or six p.m. now. Uh, yeah, let's save. Uh, um. Yeah, these crates here are for weapons later on that we can stack uh, in our safe houses. Perhaps for... I don't remember if we can pick up anything we drop off at any one of them at any others. Or just that one specifically. Okay, Aaron boy. I need you to scout out the APR position south of you. Big place here for you to put in I want you to perform reconnaissance. There's observation point marked on map. Go there now. Okay, scouting this time. Let's see, one is the machete, two is the pistol, three is the main, four is the special, and five is the map. Uh, how do we throw grenades? Uh, R brings up the menu again, or the HUD again. Okay, it'll probably tell us at some point. Yeah, it did also tell us that we can swap between grenades and monotovs. I've always been nervous when anyone swaps you with fire. Okay, maybe take the small hidden path. <laughs> yeah. Uh, where is this little pass then? Oh, oh, Demi. Wait. I wouldn't really call this a hidden pass. <laughs> so it tells me you really shouldn't run with the machete in that manner. You can press and hold rubber to use your monocular. Okay, target things in the camp, scout for animal pals, sniper points, mounted weapons, da -da. But you can't tag things. And it is really just a monocular, not a binocular. Let's see, three guys over there. Some fuel and... It's not useful to bring up this map immediately after and block your sight of anything else. Wait, Mark? 
Okay, I don't remember a marking system in this. Okay. Scout for snipers. Did it have? We already said that. Yeah, what now? Hey, got your intel. Not bad. You see a bricked up building down there? We think APR's got a hostage in there. Some foreigner like you. Get in there and bust them out. Finish up your recon if you think it'll help. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure we would have been spotted by now, but oh well. What are these other things that we can mark? I saw it turn green there for a bit. Oh, my, oh, mountain gun. Yeah, we'll want to know about that. And a bricked up building. I see a metal plate one. Um, yeah, I'm not seeing which one specifically they'd mean. I think it's up there. So, might oh. be behind the metal building. Yeah, according it with the map, it's it's behind. It's that one over there. Okay. Is there anything else that we can spot? Or let's just go. Okay. Some cover. There is stealth in this game, but uh, it's kind of busted. So basically, the moment you get spotted, everything will come running towards you. So, it's not worthwhile? Yeah. Uh, let's not stand too close to the ammo. And that guy took a bullet to the head and kept going. Starting weapon, of course, isn't going to have too much punch. Oh, uh, I probably should have remembered the freaking mounted gun. What the heck was that? Oh, uh, was that a flare or something? There's a lot more people in this place, though. I think there's at least six. I think we kill three. Oh, uh, you are not the brightest bulb in the Christmas tree, are you? Or, wait, are you? I feel like you're trying to reinvent that uh, curve so many times. Okay, they were just down, not dead. <laughs> okay, uh, we full on that. And yeah, this game came out before the time of vaulting over things or through windows. Is this the place? Okay, that's a uh, save in the middle of an app in the Caesar. Holy shit, what is this? Come on, asshole, let's go. Never mind, man, I'm not gonna fight an invalid. That's a bad case of malaria you got. How are you? Uh, how is everyone you know, <laughs> figuring that out? I uh, have a buddy, best buddy will contact you with alternate uh, ways to complete missions and gain additional rewards. Go follow me. And hey, you make it out of here alive and you see me at Mike's bar. Maybe I can get some pills for that cough of yours. Oh, so uh, we're coughing? <laughs> oh, we were earlier, but okay. Hmm. Oh, very good. Who know you turn out to be competent after all? Fair enough. Guys that do good work get paid. Come on back up to the slaughterhouse and I'll make good on that. Okay, let's go back to our car. Oh, more
more side effects or you know there, there was just a uh, our stamina going low okay uh, the car should be right over here yep there it is our ugly little lemon and yeah there, as far as I remember there isn't really a fast travel system in this game yep and you see a horrible driver well these roads are also horrible yeah though I had the I can fix that if you want. Well, it is tradition. Uh, I could have driven this thing off the road into the river right there. But... There we go. Do you always fell through the map? Uh, <laughs> our head got stuck through, but uh, oh, hello, that thing has a gun on it. And yeah, yeah, we're taking that. It. And we don't need to heal up since apparently we're on full health already. that flickering light isn't too annoying and uh, yeah this guy is surprisingly helpful to us uh, let's swap yeah. out for a fresh gun because do our he... guns will start to degrade yeah but do I, I don't think it shows a good uh, base location yeah okay that is telling us of uh, well yep the Easter egg hunt with these diamond cases. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I want to be surprised if men get malaria here because of they don't take down the rotting meat. I malaria comes from mosquitoes, not uh, the not meat. I know, but if I remember right, blood and like rotting meat, I mean, it's blood or not, and so it could attract mosquitoes. You know, the insect log of uh, corpses. So you could have flies, mosquitoes, your swarm in the area. At, at least I think mosquitoes like it. Yeah. Yeah, maybe it. I don't know if it can be transferred from uh, beef to people. Yeah, probably not, but just the flies themselves uh, starting to infest the uh, flesh could become a health risk. Okay, it's in the cart here. Yeah, but yeah, as, but I think we, we can agree. Even if at least like not malaria, the bodies can do, the yeah, the flesh can do. But there's other things that the rotting meat can give you, just being near it. And yeah, there it was mentioning the weapon degradation. If we want weapons that won't jam and explode on us, because some will explode, we'll need to go buy them or. Unlock them at the least. What? Once we've bought a weapon, we can always go back and get another uh, of it. Oh dear. Oh. Okay, that was an ammo case that we ran over. Uh, the yeah, if you if you hit those, uh, or if you shoot those, uh, yeah, they're going off like a bag of popcorn. 
Maybe you never hold a gun in real life, man. I'm not really planning to ever have a functional weapon. Maybe de decommissioned, maybe one or two decommissioned ones of like iconic things for decoration on the wall or something. But made so they can't function physically. Yeah, ba basically completely filled with concrete or something to make them useless. Alright, that could be a spot here. Alright, you're right, Yeah, this is a neutral zone, so if we start shooting, everyone starts shooting at us. Yeah, it's, it's, you can see it faintly on the radar there. In a ceasefire troops, if you trespass into restricted zones, okay. Uh, find them on your map, not the radar. So yeah, we we passed through a tiny bit of it there. And yeah, the yellow line on the map shows where the ceasefire ends, the ceasefire zone ends. And if we exit it, does the radar screen go back to normal or does it stay that blue okay it's that the blue is normal and on the map here on the right you there's a flashing uh, tent and floppy disk <laughs> icon that's the safe zone that is uh, locked at the moment okay eyes up on the road Okay then. The weapon shop inside you can spend diamonds. Yep. Because we don't want to always go back to the slaughterhouse to get a new rifle. If the arms dealer is here, I'll offer you missions that will unlock new uh, weapons and equipment. That uh, through the computer. Currently, the arms dealer is unavailable. Okay. So yeah, <laughs> old ass PCs as well. Like the the last time I had a, one of these was like in the nineties. Standard fight assault rifles and shotguns are good for intermediate and short range. Submachine and guns, light machine gun, give the possibility to have full auto option in every weapon slot. Three automatic weapons that just definitely stacks the odds in your favor. Okay. Let's see, what do we have access to? We have the GK G3. Uh, the Makarov pistol. And that's about it. Uh, yeah, these are IEDs, not hand expl uh, rocket launchers. Uh, no, not that. Okay. Uh, you'll find unlimited quantities available in the armory next door. Yep. And there's that ch stock chime sound again. Okay, over here's the armory. And yeah, once we'd get further into this game, this place would be absolutely stocked to the walls, literally, uh, with guns. For now, let's freshen these up, even though we already had a fresh one of those. There you go, let's go to the back now. Wait, where are these from? Are, are these are these perhaps D Steam DLC that came with it or something? And yeah, is that a shotgun through. with a silencer? I think that's a authentic rifle, an old fashioned hunting rifle. Yeah, yeah, let's... Uh, this thing is sawed off, I think. Even though it, it wait, it's no, it's just just it's a short a barrel. Off. It has the little uh, aiming thing at on there. So yeah, that that's original. Yeah, I guess that could be a 
I think we both know there was many rich hunters visiting Africa. Yeah. So there could be some uh, leftover of those elephant guns. No, I don't think this is an elephant gun. <laughs> no, this is just a shotgun. Yeah. So they did, I think pretty sure some people used those for hunting. And over here is the bar. Now, uh, I'm not sure, what would you use a hunting shotgun for? Uh, any th I don't really think shotguns are meant for hunting. Or at least not double barrel ones. They, they did use it in the past for hunting, but I think they was pretty become later, you know, like illegal. Okay, this is your first and best buddy because he's our only friend that may automatically makes him our best friend. This buddy will contact you during missions to offer an alternate ways to complete missions as you, as your reward, you'll increase your reputation, upgrade your safe houses. So basically, you want to do that. All the rat piss you can drink. Still sick? That guy can get you your medicine. I'm Warren, Warren Clyde. And I owe you a big one. If you ever get in the jam, you call me. I can say this. And hunting rifle, there has been shotguns used for hunting, but those that probably used them the most were. Yeah, those that only hunted for the head. Yeah. Hence why it probably is illegal. There's the bloody quick, alright? That's it. That's all I've got. Uh, think you're well, aren't you going to this? You're a jackboot. That's what you are. Okay, yeah, let, nice to meet you too. You're a jackboot. That's what you are. Uh, why would we even want this tape? You're and why are we getting pushed away from him? Uh, hello? Jackboot. That's what you are. Are you sure that is the guy we want to talk to? Yeah, shut up. Did the game break? Find someone who can provide medicine. You're a jackboot. That's what you are. It, it is glowing as if it is interactable. But I can't interact. That's what your friends usually do. You're a jackboot. Yeah, shut up. And yeah, I think the game might have been might have broken itself. Uh, can I leave and re-enter? This is an old ass game. Yeah, it's not really like that. I think I did have a drink uh, the thought of how old the Far Cry games are now. I'm gonna work with the best. Not like the guys they got around here. These PMCs are full of total amateurs. I'll see you later. Then again, I keep forgetting how old I am as well, so... You're a jackboot. Uh, it's pushing me away from here. You're a jackboot. That's what you are. Yes, yes. Just shut up or I'll, this jack will shove his boots up your ass. Well, aren't you going to destroy it? That's what your friends usually do. Uh, yeah, I, th I think the game is broken. And what the heck is a yak boot? You're a jack boot. That's what you are. Yeah, Sug. Okay. Right. Uh, is there anything on this? Uh, this might be a frequent thing. Let's see. Far Cry 2. Uh, stuck in first room. That's probably not it. Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, da, da, da. Okay, L let's do a quick save and then try a restart. Or let's. Let's go back to the menu, then back in. Maybe that will fix it. You'd have visited Far Cry, the Far Cry site. <laughs> Stuck in bar. Yeah. 
Nope, same. Uh, blinking audio tape, cannot press E. Hand icon never shows, constantly shaking back and forth. Uh, yeah, picked up weapon, check your objective. Try enabling V-Sync when limiting your FPS. Yeah. Okay, let's try that then. Display. V-Sync, yes. And then limit that to 60. Not that it would show up in the stream or recording anyways, because those are limited to 60 frames a second. Okay, at least it's not pushing me away anymore. Why is... Wait, you're not here for the pills, are you? Well, I see the problem now. You can get the pills you need from the church in Pala. The priest there will help you, assuming you make it in time. Just passes along for me. Okay, I'm guessing... Um, we talked about this a bit before. We could help each other, you and I. Hmm? So you're not one of them. I'm Ruben Oluagendi, what you call a stringer. And you are new, I can tell by the state of your clothes. You're much too clean. You're taking a chance talking to me. I'm persona non grata around here. The warlords want me out of the country. They don't like the story I'm writing. It's about the war, and about them, of course. But mostly it's about the famous arms dealer, Tujaka. That was him on the table. Do you know I have covered 16 wars across Africa? 16. And every time he has been there, selling his weapons and making a fortune while millions of people suffer and die. He thinks he can continue to do his work in secret, but not this time. These stories, they are going to come out. The Jackas, the warlords, the soldiers, the boy soldiers, even the NGOs. I intend to expose the whole sordid mess. I make it sound very dramatic. We'll see if anybody back home even notices. I've been interviewing people for months now. Diplomats, warlords, civilians, wherever I could trick into talking to me. I had some fantastic material. Then the soldiers confiscated my tapes. They said they destroyed them, but maybe not. I don't know. I can't very well go looking for them. I'm no good with a gun, you see. And you need one these days just across the street. You've seen the fighting. The war is getting worse by the minute. It's absurd. Because why are they fighting? For what? You can see the country is destroyed. The people, the diamonds, the cities. What about the ridges on with the jackass weapons, no less? It is going to end badly. And I'm afraid I'll be here to see it. I'm a bit of a robber neck, I suppose. Listen, if you find any more of my tapes, please bring them back to me. They are the bar. I need them for my story. I'll tell you right now, I can't pay you. I can only offer you my worthless friendship in return. At least he's honest. Yep. But, uh, yeah, Africa is, uh, in many places, very unstable. And, come on, now the door glitched. Yeah, but not everywhere. For there are many places that are all quite nice, I hear. Yeah, and not as you... portrayed in the movie, as you see in movies. For there are many wonderful, well, and advanced cities in Africa. Not every part of Africa looks like this. Yeah. There, uh, there are people who think that all of Africa is just mud huts and such. Uh, but that isn't the case. And... Far from the case, even. Yeah. But corruption is a big problem in a lot of it. I can't say all of it, but a lot of it. And I've talked to... Oh. Second best buddy. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, we only just met, and I guess that makes us uh, second best friends somehow. <laughs> and, uh, this will be buddy will be here at the safe house you unlocked. You may get inside missions from your... your side missions from your body if you're down in body if you're down in battle you can count on this body to rescue you i think i know who you are people are talking about you Muy bien. if you ever need any help come find me my name is William. and i think i heard the doorbell there so let me check quick all right
Okay, back. Uh, family back. friend looking for someone who isn't here at the moment. But yeah, for that I'll add five minutes to this. Uh, oh, we're, we're almost on the hour with this, I think, already. Uh, yep, oh well, uh, five minutes act anyways. Yep, and what's the last, what did you have your hand on her belly? <laughs> I've commanded. It's the interact button. Okay, is that all? Okay. Finally, we're let out by uh, the friendship. <laughs> we had a spirit of friendship or something. <laughs> yeah, the friendship, the, the magic of friendship was keeping the door locked for us. I saw something weird. Mm -hmm. uh, go back a bit to the table from there. Oh, mm -hmm. come on, seriously? What? I think. I've seen tons of people owning chairs look just like them in real life. <laughs> yeah, the, these chairs are practically everywhere in the, on the freaking planet. Though this one looks like they are even lower quality than those. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay. Uh, calm, calm down on Helion, calm down. I know you, the chairs are fury, you, but don't take your face out on the table. Oh, hello, we're close to another diamond cache. And it's right over here, in this hut. Okay. Uh, oh, okay, that fires both at the same time. No, oh, come on! <laughs> How weak are the shots in that? If a machete will hit through it, but a bullet will not. Well, yeah, these these things also give off a bit of sound. And yeah, the amount of diamonds that we'll find will vary by stash. The, uh, these easy ones, of course, will just have a little, if my memory serves me right. Yeah, here's nothing here. Does Africans really anyone actually you know live in a hut made of metal? Mm, well, there are plenty. Oh, that's yeah, the wrong way side. Uh, there are plenty of places where, yeah, people have to scavenge for whatever they can find to make a, a house out of. Like uh, you can see it in Brazil, I think. Like with those, uh, I forget what they are. Called actually, uh, Vavelas or something. Yeah, your problem is a hut made of metal in a warm climate. Um, yeah, that doesn't sound smart. Uh, it sounds like a good way to cook yourself. Yeah, it, it'll keep the rain out, and the rain is typically what bothers people more, since too much of that can. Cause you to die of dehydration. Then, on the other hand, of course, uh, dying of <clears throat> heat stroke also isn't nice. Yeah, metal roof, fine, but maybe don't make the entire house of metal. But uh, plates of sheet metal like that are the easiest building material to work with. And another cache. Okay. in here but that is okay let's triangulate a bit yep it's in there but that that would mean that we'd have to no kill the guards probably and well then just oh hello I'll just uh, reach in here <laughs> and carefully back away. Oh, Lord, it's gonna be so heavily yelled at. <laughs> yeah, he's probably going to get uh, <laughs> he's probably get such a beating that his ass will tighten up enough to turn coal into new diamonds. <laughs> Uh, oh, 
Oh, wait, I... I need to be up the front. <laughs> uh, I was often expecting we'd have to sneak in somewhere. Not really sneak in somewhere, but... Where is... Now we're back here again. No, oh, the church. The church is where we need to go. It's still full, but always good to make it a habit to just pass through. Yep, dedicated medicine button. Those will only last a short while, but I may not be Not all of my people have left. Many are trapped, scared of what will happen if they are caught trying to leave. And there are others who have chosen to stay. We try to help where we can, and we could use some of them. Okay, the no interact button. <coughs> but yeah, similar to Anthes in, in uh, Dying Light, uh, we'll need that medication to keep ourselves alive. Uh, but one thing that many have complained about with this is that when you get any, when you get those pills, it doesn't show you how many you actually get, and how many you actually have. So yeah, oh. we'll we'll need to make frequent visits back to this place. And that's the tutorial. The Leon at UFLL headquarters marked with uh, that. Pills will keep your melee in check for now. You are free to explore the world. Safe houses, guard posts, scout for intel. Diamonds can be found for exploration. Used to purchase guns, side missions, travel safely from... Oh yeah, the bus stations are the fast travel. Somewhere out there is an arms dealer known only as the Jackal. He has been selling guns to both the UFLL and the APR. Every gun, every bullet and every corpse you have seen can be traced directly back to him. Find him and kill him. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I, I have to say that I still like the graphics of this place. They aren't as high definition as Dying Light, but you still get most of it across and not most things don't look absolutely ugly. Yeah, though there has been some that is a bit awkward, but otherwise it looks good. Yeah. And yeah, apparently we just we just can't move around at all without a weapon in our hands. <laughs> like it's an insecurity or something. <laughs> right. Right. Hand over the hard yeah. This guy takes our guns and searches us for anything hidden. Because well we're heading into a headquarters of a faction. <laughs> They don't want anyone showing up with like a, a pocket pistol and just offing their faction leader. It, as, yeah, as obviously video game as this game is, they do have little things like that that uh, work to immerse you a bit. Yeah, I would give them bonus points for that. Yeah, which is in part again why I'd like to see this remade or remastered. For the FLF, you call me to Takakumba. You're still around. Good. We need free horses. Challenge. Oh, it's him again. Special forces out of an area just gun for hired guys, but they are armed to the teeth. They are paid to parachute in and grab someone. He doesn't need to know who. It's okay if he knows. They're here for a big shot from the APR, but if we take our enemy, we got nobody to fight. Just get to the point. The FF team is set up in good position in the desert, two kilometers to southeast. The Kumba kid doesn't want anybody to think he planned secret rendition would make him look bad. Enough, please. All you have to do is to find this man and destroy the Avetis. The gear in their vehicles, radios, water, canteens, ammo, all the gear they dropped in. 
This is our struggle, not the guys we're up against. We do not need outside involvement. I expect you to stop this man. The job is yours. Yeah, outside involvement, and he hires an outsider to do that. Then they are nice and screwed. Tail is here. Don't forget, this is secret mission. So you have fellow guys both know you. Don't expect any help out there. Yep. Uh, both factions will uh, try to kick her ass for this. Though I do have to wonder one bit here. I, it basically implies that they are sent. This team has been sent in to kidnap or kill the leader of the other faction, and uh, you guys might want to vacuum a bit. Were those cockroaches glowing? Uh, yeah, I'm guessing this is. You take, uh, I'm guessing this is a prequel to Fallout then. <laughs> Oh no! I'm a mile east of town, safe house by the pond. Meet me there. What the? Yeah, that's uh, our buddy. <laughs> well, yeah. Um, where was I? Yeah, that. I think what they meant is that that team is uh, meant to take out uh, the head of the other faction, which has their headquarters right across there. You can see it right here in the map with that signal, or its sigil on it. Uh, on the one hand, you'd think they'd want them to be taken out, but yeah, I'm guessing they'd want these guys want to uh, be the ones doing that to be able to take credit for that, and well, to not have some third party like the CIA jump in to try and take control of the uh, situation. Hmm. So it's just maybe a sort of enemy of my enemy uh, doesn't make the first one my friend, but it, it's an, uh, <clears throat> a common enemy. There's probably someone who can uh, explain things a bit better than I did. And yeah, we'll be running around this with this machete in our hands for quite a bit. Yeah, uh, we are room about room. at the time, but once again, let's finish things up a bit. Yeah, but we also have to remember, this is the situation that in Rome's table is actively encourage them to keep fighting, even that the Norwegian will do it. Yeah, I'm guessing part of why the uh, UFLL, I'll just call them the UF, want to keep fighting is so they can grab as much land as possible and such. Like, uh, with... Uh, if the uh, APR lost its head, they might the the new person might sue for peace, and yeah, then it would look really bad if the UF kept fighting anyways, which could well, draw others into the war to stop them, as they'd be the aggressor then. Yeah. Oh, uh, that confirms that. And that's our car dying. So let's let's get at least as much distance as we can. And there's a diamond deposit near. Where the car goes? And yeah, priorities, huh? <laughs> Diamonds nearby, and I immediately switch to that. And that was our car. Yeah, that guy is very, being very antsy. Yeah, yeah, big mouth, small gun. Should have reloaded earlier. Yeah, and this guy, uh, I think this guy was Dutch. From if uh, that's what he said, sounded a bit odd. Um, you do know the the language called Afrikaans. 
if I pronounce that right, is yeah. It's it's basically <laughs> Dutch with an accent. <laughs> Oh, now, of course, it's not exactly that, since it still has a lot of words of its own, but still. How do you pronounce those? Uh, which one? Dutch or Afrikaans? The first one, Afrikaans. Yeah. That one also. Well, when I try to pronounce it, I sound very Swedish, like how we say. Yeah, from what well, we call people from Africa and Africa. <laughs> okay. uh, let's go to the blue arrow that our last guy seems to have run away. And uh, yeah, the diamond marks on the map are ones that we've already found. That that is nice that they mark. The ones that you've already found, because usually games do not do that, uh, which is helpful when you're making like a guide or using a guide to see where all the other ones are that you haven't found. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Mm. What is that radar dish? Uh, hello. Yep. <laughs> okay. Uh, that was quite a welcoming party, party to the region. <laughs> and yeah, my, this will show off how our our second best buddy will help us out then. Uh, yeah, Merc's got to stick together. We do have to be a bit careful here because I'm pretty sure our buddies can get killed. And who was she shooting at? Yeah, that, if I remember right, that, that body was a bit of a healer body. Okay, you're yeah. still here. And yeah, again, before vaulting became a common thing in games. Um, okay, it seems they've run off. Though she is still shooting at something or someone. I hope I expect you to be attacked by dinosaurs for some reason. <laughs> Too much arc. That and probably also uh, Camp Cretaceous and all that. I still need to watch the latest season of that. Oh, hello there. I'm not going to overhype it, but as I say, it, it's worth a watch. For the... Yeah, so far what people think is the best season so far of Country Desert is the first one and the third one. Ah, there. And there seems to be hint that there is indeed more season coming. So there are also also planned and ending. So the room of Country Desert to be about uh, two or five seasons may have some credit. Okay. Uh, our body should be safe now. So let's check out this radar dish thing, and then we'll head. Well, then we'll take the long way to the blue. Th uh, oh, of, of course, <laughs> it wouldn't be a Far Cry game without freaking radio towers. Wait, are the radio towers versus Far Cry Primal? Uh, can I not interact? Nope. Okay, that must be something else then for later on. Maybe you need to blow it up? Mm, no idea, but it's at least it's not needed for getting info on the region and such. Yeah. Okay, continuing on. 
Diskin var klart med dig till Raiden. Eller om det är en av oss. Det var inte en av oss. Det var en av oss. Det var en bit av off-roading. Through trees that seem to be made out of endamantium. And as long as a car hasn't blown up, it can still be repaired. So uh, we can work on the smoke screen in a bit. Uh, yeah, I'm still expecting a dinosaur to attack you. <laughs> yeah, I, I wouldn't mind a new Far Cry game with dinosaurs, uh, not one that isn't Blood Dragon. Like that, that game was fun, but it will also was very short. Wait, that had dinosaurs? Yeah, uh, uh, cyber dinosaurs. Oh. And we can add that to the stream list if you want. Uh, maybe. For Craig Primal, I am a bit more curious of. I think I might have gotten that one on sale, but I'm not sure. Yeah, but, but was that game good also? Uh, from what I've heard, people say it was certainly something. And oh, hello. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. Also, something about this. Uh, these patrols are just relentless. They will just not give up on chasing you. Uh, what was the button to switch? There we go. We have to kill them. Is the accuracy of this thing just so terrible? But it is shaking a lot, so... I think you might find better cover somewhere else, jackass. Okay. Yeah, something that is likable in this game as well is that there aren't really just outright game indicators and such. The, if the car is damaged, you'll see it by the amount of smoke coming out of it. And if a mounted gun is overheating, you'll see by the uh, amount of smoke coming from it. Oh, oh yeah, let's see what Clyde is up to over here. And then maybe call it. I might be good idea. Nope. Okay, we almost had goat for dinner. I don't think I've ever actually had goats. I'm sure. I'm, I have eaten gator, and I have eaten moose. But don't you eat a bunny or a goat? Hey, sir. What do you know? What do you say? So these special forces guys are coming in, right? I got a plan. You know that villa? There's this little guy in there. He's working with the SF guys, radioing codes over the short wave. I was thinking you could go pay him a visit. Convince him to give those guys the wrong directions. Send them straight to the shanty town. I mean, you're supposed to hit them in the desert, right? Screw that. No cover out there. You're better off hitting them close quarters. And besides, I'll be there to help. I don't like a bunch the of face animation. Radio. There's some personality there without looking weird. You know what? Yeah. Soldiers, I mean. They're on the payroll for this NGO. Their mission is to snatch and grab this guy who's been stealing medical aid. That guy's me. And get this, eh? I've been selling the shit to the APR. And now they're gonna help me take out the posse so I can keep stealing gear and selling it to them at 100% markup. <laughs> okay, you're a right bastard, aren't you? But then again, everyone is here. The APR figures out that I'm the guy that's been stealing their gear and reselling it to them. If they put it together, I might need your help. Like immediately. Okay, but what makes you so important to the APR then? Besides, well, that. Okay, what's with the puppy do eye dogs? <laughs> Dog <Ooh>. eyes? <laughs> <laughs> oh, and he didn't like that remark. <laughs> Find the little guy at the villa. Get him on the radio. Ooh. Take him from the soldiers to the shanty. Oh, no, that, uh, that thing is rusted to hell and back. Does that mean you should not use it? And yeah. Is that gold? Is that gold or corn? Yeah, that's corn. Uh, if that was gold, uh, this guy would have been long gone already. Unless he's very greedy. 
Okay, your call. Do we continue to finish this mission, or should we call it here? Uh, might as well call it for... Yeah, we're almost approaching three hours. Yeah. All right, then. So, let's take a quick look at if anyone is watching this at the moment. Come on. I give this thing a shake and it turns on the freaking flashlight. Oh yeah, I forgot. Idle animations is also a thing with this game where... I'm, I'm, I don't think this game... No, it, how, I'm pretty sure that Unreal already had idle animations with weapons. Uh, hello, Tattoo. Uh, okay, network error. This is still live, so... Yeah. Safety switch. Did my, did my phone's receiver die or something? Now, so some people may have noticed that I... Uh, I reached over here for this thing to watch for the, the stream chat. And over here, I have this thing to check things out. I think I've told the story of this before, but basically, uh, we, I got, well, me and the, my brother got this one for my father for Father's Day because his old phone was dying. And this thing is not making any connection. Uh, but yeah, we wanted to give him that one, but after the fact, we cleaned out his old phone and. Yeah, suddenly it was working again, so he, he didn't want this one anymore. So now I have a, well, a gaming phone and a contact phone. Or in this case, a Twitch chat phone. <laughs> if it wants to work, that is. Otherwise, I'll have to go through OBS's stream chat, which has been proven to be inaccurate. Okay, come on. Okay, so anyone who I may not mention here... Uh, that might be because I either think you are a bot or th you're just not showing up in the list, which can happen. Okay, but here we go then. Uh, XX Demon Kitty, thank you for watching. Uh, you are a good kitty, even if you are from hell. Rogue Girl, thank you for watching as well. Uh, stay rogue. Junker Thing, thank you as well. Uh, you aren't junk to me. And that is a bot. I should probably ban that one. Uh, that one's also a bot. And as always, special thanks to you, Dick here. Oh, you're most welcome. And uh, yeah, this has been something Monday to make up for a bit of a, <laughs> a bit bad quality uh, something Sunday. Uh, tomorrow we'll be continuing with Orcs Must Die. And on that, we have some news. Orcs Must Die 3 has been confirmed to come out next month on the 23rd. <laughs> and the, the trailers of it and the preview footage of it looks good. But, of course, that's the whole point of trailers and previews, that to make the game look better than it might be. So, well, I did, I did have a quite a good laugh from the trailer you sent me. Yeah. Uh, I will... I don't think by... A, we still have a few more games to go after Orcs Must Die before we get to when I'd, be, I'd have planned in for Orcs Must Die 3 to be streamed. So that, that should still be enough time for some reviews to come out. There's still like a 60 to 70% chance that I will buy it anyways. But if it turns out by the reviews that it is just uh, garbage, then uh, yeah, then I'm not sure if I would be streaming it. I don't expect it to be garbage, because Orcs Must Die 1 and 2 have been proving to be pretty amusing to me. But there is always, always a chance. N Nothing is 100% sure. Always go with like 95% surety. And surety, is that even a word? Yeah, yeah that's a good question. And luckily enough, they should have at least one extra year to fix out any bugs and such. True. But. So that's very, yeah. yeah. That'll be for us to find out then. And yep. at, until then. Until then, everyone. Be safe, folks. And watch out for alligators.